Hello my darlings and welcome to my channel. So today's reading is gonna be about your future spouse. Um, we're gonna look at their characteristics, personality, how you can meet, career, finances, so you know approximately who is this person. Um, we're also gonna see how things will start between you and when approximately you will meet, okay? So let's see, you can choose a pile, I mean a stone, it's going to be four piles today. So let's do that. Stone number one, somehow I want to come from this side first, okay? This is going to be pile number one, this rainbow stone or however you call it. Stone, uh, pile number two will be this uh, green stone. Pile number three will be this blue stone. And pile number four will be this brown moonstone. Okay? Just use your intuition. I hope you can see the stones. Uh, use your intuition the first three to five seconds. That's when it works. Um, after that, your mind starts working. So keep keep this in mind. Otherwise, you can just pause and pick your stone. One, two, three, and four. And we are about to start. So whoever chose this stone, pile one, let's see. <clears throat> Who is your future spouse? Their characteristics, personality, something you need to know about them, okay? About your future spouse. Mm-hmm. Wow. <laughs> okay. First of all, right away, I want to say uh, your future spouse could be a fire sign. Doesn't have to be. Or this person is very very energetic this person is very fast uh, moving uh, it could be physically or just how they deal with things how they uh, work uh, maybe they work on their career maybe they're a boss or a, a, someone maybe they have their own business or they always multitask they do uh, several things at time at one time so they're very very energetic uh very passionate um this person also very passionate i also want to say this person uh loves um sexual sexual sensual uh, connection even if we, uh, if with their wife or husband doesn't matter this person uh, for this person the sex part is very very important I want to say not as much as uh, this person not as much as traditional but as even though they are uh, with the queen of uh, pentacles but at the same time this person it's important for this person your future spouse how the uh, sex part is going uh, do you have chemistry together because if you not this person uh, would uh, search for it somewhere else but again we're looking at uh, your future spouse which means somehow some reason they would feel uh, a lot of uh, sexual attraction and connection to you because that strongly feel to you why because um there is like um, king of wands and queen of pentacles. So I feel that they will have a strong sexual connection to you. And that way you're going to be the only one in their horizon. In their, um, uh, You are the only aim or the only person who they will need and be fulfilled with. Okay, I want to say that. 
Uh, also, I see about this person that it could be this person in the past was hurt by someone or rejected by someone or they rejected someone. Um, I see something didn't work out. Uh, it could be with the Queen of um, Swords, could be any gender. Uh, there was someone who either cut them off or they cut someone off. Something has ended. So by the time you meet this person, this person will be single. I don't feel this person will be married. They could have been before or they just had a relationship or someone who it, things didn't work uh, with, okay? Uh, but when they meet you, I feel, uh, they would strongly feel that you are uh, someone for a family somehow. Even though they more will be attracted to you sexually, still, they're going to see a great potential in you. Uh, that you can be their future spouse even. Or maybe just a potential to move forward in this connection, okay? I hope you can see, guys. Okay. So, uh, otherwise, this person is very energetic, very good at their career or whatever they do, they're very excited about it. They know how to uh, deal with problems. They love to solve uh, some uh, situations. Uh, even could be some people come for them to ask them, okay, uh, I am in this situation, how, uh, how, how can I solve it? And they give them advice or they tell them, you know what, go here and there or here is the number of a person, he can help you. So this person can uh, help others to go through certain problems and they feel very, um, you know, they know how who they are and they feel very proud of themselves that they can help others even if it's just by giving uh, someone's number or uh, suggesting something also it could be in their work but we will see about their work later on okay now let's see how uh, can you meet this person like maybe how this meeting will go with, with you and this person your future spouse where can you meet how Okay, first of all, at work. I'm going to give uh, several uh, options because it's a general reading. Please understand. F for some, you'll meet this person at work. This is your co-worker or will be your co-worker or could be even your boss. Okay? Or maybe you are their boss. It depends. Uh, for others, uh, this person could be uh, providing certain services that will help you somehow to find your path, your role. Maybe they will be. Maybe they will be the one who suggests you someone. Let's say you will ask them. Okay, uh, maybe you're going for some consultation, and this person will tell you, you know what, you should go here and there they will suggest you someone else maybe or they literally will help you to solve a certain problem that you will have at the time you will meet okay it could also yes it could also be you going uh, somewhere where they live or where they work i feel like because here you enter the house and here you already in the house so uh could be either the place where they work or literally their house or someone's house you will meet it could be you going to your relatives or someone that you know and they will be there in that particular place okay or uh, maybe this maybe you build in a house just an example right and this person will be your real estate or this person will be the cons contractor or how do you call them constructor who's helping you to build it or maybe you need to do renovations and this person is coming to help you somehow they will provide certain help services to you um, literally or maybe they send someone to you or help you with a suggestion su suggesting someone else okay but this is going to be considering certain materialistic things in the real world uh, that you will need to solve or to do and then this person appears uh, and helps you on the way 
or is someone from your work who you work with, with okay could be as well as I said uh, could also be here this person is very intuitive uh, very intuitive and uh, maybe I don't know just for some maybe even do it magic or something I don't know something uh, there maybe their work related to something um, spiritual doesn't have to be maybe they're just great intu intuitive person that's it okay okay that was the um, how can you meet now let's look at their career uh, somewhere they work maybe um, and what about their finances uh, so you know approximately uh, what this person does for career work finances when you meet them or in general mm -hmm. Okay, again, uh, several possibilities here. Several possibilities. First of all, uh, this person can literally be a, a con uh, how do you say it? Constructor, designer, uh, someone who's building something. Uh, because I see a building here, here, high rise building. Could, could also mean this person works in a high rise building. Uh, also, this person is very smart and um, they work with their head. Let's say if they're designer, they have to think with their head how to put things together. Or uh, even if they are doing construction, they're uh, more of the one who's uh, making blueprints. Or they more have, but first they have to think with their head how to make it happen and then they work. Or maybe they have workers who does the, the, the job for them, but they're the boss, let's say, okay? Uh, somehow they have to use their intuition, their head, their mind to solve things to uh, when it comes to work. It could also be that this person, um, it's related to sport somehow. Uh, maybe they literally working, they're doing something with their hands or they use something to uh, work maybe they're um, a coach or they're lifting up things i don't know something they hold in their hands maybe okay again this is a general reading you take as it resonates with you um, for others this person could be a doctor a nurse someone in the medical field uh, because I have here uh, some sense of uh, medicine, okay? Another thing I want to say, maybe when you meet this person, this person will change career or this person will change job or maybe they go into a new place at work. Maybe they will come to your work and that's how you meet. Maybe you'll meet them at work and that will be the person that uh, someone knew at your work or they move in different department. Some movement could happen here or recently happen when you meet them. Uh, they will tell you about this or they will be moving uh, to either other level of their job or their career or there maybe also can be if there, let's say, a, um, a constructor or someone who's building things, maybe they will finish the project and they're moving to a new project here, okay? Some uh, step, some uh, change is going on here. I feel that. Uh, another thing is uh, where this person can work. Yes, for some this person uh, working somewhere with, where, uh, with the chariot, maybe moving, let's say uh, traveling for work, uh, driving on a car or doing some movings, I don't know, movements, 
something with their hands when they have to use uh, their power, strength, literally. For others, maybe this person have um, transportation a company and they ha that's why maybe they have a lot of cars. Maybe they work at a dealership. Uh, again, for everyone is different, but again, for, uh, for most, this person needs to work with their head in order to accomplish certain job, okay? I don't see much as their regular workers. I more see that they have, uh, they are more of a boss or have, hold higher positions and other people do the job. That's what I more here, feel here, okay? Even though for some it could be they literally lifting things up or... But anyway, whatever they do, they they good at their work they know what they're doing they um they are professional at their job whatever they do okay even if they literally building a house and they're working there right they know exactly where to put the brick where to do do, do this this person is very smart i want to tell you okay and has a great potential to you know uh financial abundance if not already but in the future yes with the empress so that's what i had for the career and finances uh, so far i see this person is working or changing jobs but i see this is not someone who will stay home and do nothing i do not see that this person is very striving yes thinking a lot with their mind with their head a, sm a smart wise person here okay beautiful um, then we want to see how things will start between you when you meet let me see that how things will start between you how this relationship will go when you meet let me see this <clears throat> How this relationship will go. <laughs> okay. Well, I want to say right away, you will scare this person uh, like crazy. Why? Because uh, they would instantly feel uh, that they're falling in love and it will scare them uh, a lot it will scare them because they 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 wouldn't expect this they were not thinking about uh, love right now they were more thinking about career and then you appear in this person's life <clears throat> and now whatever they were thinking before however they wanted their life before now they have to change things completely upside down and start with the full uh, start new plans how they want uh, their future to be and they suddenly will feel that you are someone for a family someone stable <coughs> sorry and um, it will scare them off right away even though they will be ready to move forward to step outside their um, comfort zone because you will shake their comfort zone where they will have to do something okay and they were not ready for it it was it's like unexpected uh and uh, now they have to release those fears they have to work on their fears um in order to get you and uh they would like you a lot yes they will have to use their temperance sometimes they temperance sorry they, sometimes they even would try to hide something from you not to show you how much they like you why because they are scared uh they not gonna show you right away their feelings it's gonna be like um you you'll just have you'll just feel their vibes you'll feel how they <clears throat> like you but they're not gonna say it in words in the beginning and then finally they will realize they love you and they will let you know definitely they will let you know and um 
that you are the world to them, that you are someone important, that uh, they adore you. They're also going to like your outer looks. They're also going to like you for who you are, your personality. Uh, and eventually, uh, at first they will try to hide it, but eventually it's going to be nearly too impossible to hide their um, how they drawn to you, how they're amazed by you, how much they like being around you, uh, how you are like their family here, okay? I feel beautiful. So at first you might, uh, it might take some time for them to work on their fears, but eventually they will realize they have to move forward in order for this connection to work, otherwise they will lose you. They realize that you are for a family, that you, uh, you're not the one who can they play around with. But they're also not a player here. They're more concentrated on their work, on their stability. And then you appear uh, when maybe they're not completely ready yet to uh, think about the family, but then they will have to start thinking and multitask. Uh, with other things and you as well yes they have to leave their um, fears behind whatever happened in the past they're leaving it if there was a broken heart uh, whatever happened in the past they're leaving it behind and they feel that you are the fate you fated for them and uh, they have to take things into their own hands be the magician and uh, start moving your way because otherwise someone else will take you they they will lose you and finally, let's see when approximately, <clears throat> when approximately can you meet? I never look too far with tarot cards, but within a year or two. Um, let's see. But when approximately so you know that you can meet? Okay, seven of spring. Uh, very close to the, especially if we count seven from today. Uh, it's going to be springtime seven months from now, right? Maybe in seven months, maybe in seven weeks or seven days. Who knows? For everyone's different. But uh, maybe at the springtime or, or when the weather for you will be like a spring. For some, it's going to be the end of winter. Because six of winter, maybe in six months. The ending of winter, the beginning of, of spring. It also depends where you live, when the spring and winter for you guys, okay? Um, yes. So I want to say six, seven months from now, could be six, seven weeks for some. And uh, for others, summer. So basically, um, from, look at this, from the beginning of next year until a summer time, that's within those six months, that's when you... Uh, can meet your future spouse, okay? But since it's a general reading, yes. But mostly I see spring and winter, okay? Mostly as for most spring and winter. And look at what I have, the lovers. This connection can get you to um, marry each other, okay? A beautiful energies here. Thank you very much, guys. Thank you very much, pile number one, uh, stone number one. I hope you liked it. Uh, maybe you already recognized such person. Maybe you didn't. Let me know in comments, please. I always read your comments. Uh, I cannot respond to all, but I always read them. And I'm very happy when uh, you realize things with my readings, okay? Or you recognize someone. Thank you very much. And I'm going to... Pile number two. Pile number two. Whoever chose this stone, green stone. Let's see. Who is your future spouse? Who is your future spouse? Let's see their characteristics, personality, something about your future spouse, right? Let's see. So, who is your future spouse? Oh my god. <laughs> wow, guys. Very interesting person you are having. <laughs> 
Wow. Okay, pile number two. Um, completely different from pile number one. Mysterious pile here. Okay. So what happened is um, your future spouse. First of all, I want to say a very attractive person. It could be uh, their outer looks. It doesn't have to be, but. Um, a lot of people pay attention to this person because this person is a mix of the devil and the hierophant. It's a very rare uh, connection. <laughs> I want to say it's like a two opposites. This person is very balanced in their uh, dark side and light side, but it's a great balance when this person knows when to be the devil and when to be the hierophant. I love it. Wow. First of all, I want to say a um, very sexual person. You're going to instantly be attracted to this person. Uh, you would also feel that this person knows that they're attractive. They know how to maybe manipulate um, in a way because they are so um, attractive again it doesn't have to be their outer looks only it could also be their energies uh, how they present themselves this person could also dress nicely um, this person uh, takes care of themselves uh, they are very, could be very very uh, knowledgeable at sex I want to tell you right away uh, also, uh, be aware, be careful. If you sleep with this person, you would, uh, you might go into addiction here. So be aware uh, where you going and uh, how soon you going there. Because, um, but since this is your future spouse, I guess you would be smart enough to not to give out to this person very easily. Because whoever's um, getting into their web i want to say easily this person doesn't uh, uh eventually not serious about them okay but i guess pile number two because you chose this pile you know you also very attractive here and also know how to be a bit manipulative somehow i feel your energies as well because i feel you are kind of mirroring each other here because for such person, the only way to actually get married is finding a similar person who is also knows their worth, who also not ready to give out themselves without uh, taking back. And that's what will drag you one to another. Okay? I love this pile. So much energy, so much passion. Uh, so I also feel... It's like when you meet this person, you would feel, okay, game on. Uh, you would feel this is not a regular person like that you met before. And this will truly attract you to them. What else I see here? Um, at the same time, this person is very fair with the Hierophant. Uh, when they feel that um, they met someone and uh, this is a good person, somehow they have great intuition here they feel like okay this person i should be careful with and they will be if they will respect you here i feel they will respect you because you are like them you are not stupid you are you know your worth you know uh that you shouldn't give out yourself right away and they will respect this in you okay even though you will be so so tempting for them they gonna um uh, be a bit different with you than they are with other people. You both instantly would feel this sexual attraction, okay? Also, this person sometimes, because they have the devil and the hierophant in their head, uh, they could be a bit conflicted in a way where uh, maybe sometimes they have those mood swings when one day 
they're passionate let's say and they're ready to risk another day they might be like you know what i don't want to do this i don't feel it's right so this um good and bad will be as i said balanced but they will like go uh, here and there in them but you would like it i feel because you are very similar to their energies what else you have to know about this person um this person i want to say broke many hearts but again not because they wanted it but that's how they are that's who they are maybe you are the same maybe you also broke many hearts here uh but the thing is what this person don't like okay that when people right away as i said in the beginning get too attached to them and get too annoying with the hangman so what they do they leave such people right away and they go further to look for another star but again don't take it as a negative right away because there are literally some people that get attracted to this person that if this person will take all those energies on themselves they will they wouldn't be uh, able to move, go on okay they have to protect themselves from certain people or certain energies okay uh, so what they do is they didn't find they didn't find yet the right person for them who will have similar energies who will have a similar interests maybe uh and this will be you because they are approaching your way and i feel you are the star for some reason you are the star who will shine who will be a bit cold not too attached like other people okay and because of this a uh, bit of coldness that you will show even though you will shine like a star but you kind of far away this person needs to get to you before they get you okay and this will uh bring this interest uh, they will be very interested in you because you are not falling for them like other people and they will right away notice that and that's what will give them this um passion to go for you and fight for you they wouldn't be lazy and waiting for you to do anything because as soon as they realize you are their person and they will realize that by your actions, by your energies, by your uh, chemistry, by your connection, uh, by the thing that you are very similar, that you're mirroring each other, this person will uh, start fighting for you. They will be like a reborn person. They will realize that this is the time, this is the time to change their beliefs, to realize it's like you will put them instantly into certain transformation. So if before they were uh, a bit uh, impulsive, not serious about things or people, you are putting them into this transformation with the judgment when they realize that this is the time to take responsibility and be the hierophant when it comes to you. If for the most people this person was the devil, for you this person will be the hierophant okay because you will take out from this person such feelings that they never felt before they never felt before that they they want to fight for someone so badly because usually that's what other people did and this time they have to take things into their own hands and start moving your way because you will be the sun to them okay they will see clearly that you are the person they want in their life they need and you are a great match here beautiful i love it uh let me see now uh how can you possibly meet how can you possibly meet how can you possibly meet mm -hmm. okay uh interesting because it's a general reading i'm gonna give you several options here 
Mm-hmm. <laughs> okay. For some, you will meet at this person's job, work. At work. More I feel at their work, which means you don't have to work together, but somehow you're going to their workplace. And this person also uh, with the devil and ace of pentacles and the knight of pentacles. This person financially very stable. I see this person also can have already some something like a house, a car, whatever they have. They they know how to make money. Uh, don't even worry. Even though we didn't look yet about their career and finances, I can already tell you this person is great at um, making money, at you know at their work either or how to manipulate through things to get what they need to feed their family themselves. Uh, this person could also have certain pets. I want to tell you. Or maybe uh, they have a big house where there are uh, different pets. Maybe the house stands where there is a, a forest. I don't know, something about forest here. But at the same time, since we're asking about how can you meet, it could be that you will go to someone's house or someone's town, or maybe your relatives or your friends, uh, and you will meet this person there. For others, as I said, you're going to their workplace where they work. It could be you need something, you're going there, uh, you need their services or you're going literally to the store and you meet this person is uh, working at that store. Maybe they're, um, I don't know, look at this, it's uh, in, in this car, just an example, right? Maybe they're selling ships. I don't know what they do. Um, but whatever they do is very productive. It's not, um, they're not a regular worker who's uh, working for, um, you know, uh, hourly paying. No, I feel here more, even if they do, this is something major. They have great paying or mostly I feel they have their own thing they do. They um, either have a business or they have maybe partners as well, I, I see here. Maybe they partner with someone, uh, maybe they have a farm, I don't know. Maybe they're um, building houses, maybe they're working with animals. Somehow, some reason, something about forest, trees could also be. Uh, for others, uh, it, yeah, th this person could be someone uh, very knowledgeable in that what they do and people know them in their surroundings in, in the society. Remember, this is general reading. <coughs> for some, this person could also uh, work in the military or somewhere when they have to wear certain, um, I don't know, costume or... Um, Maybe they even into acting. I don't know. But this person is very, as I said, very attractive energetically. And I even see the outer looks. They are very attractive here. Hmm. Interesting. It's like you see this person and you instantly realize, wow, um, where this, this, where this person came out from, you know, <laughs> what kind? I never seen such people, right? In my town, let's say, right? Uh, it's like in this picture, right? He's coming out of the forest, and we like, uh, since when such people live in the forest? <laughs> so it's something like that. Uh, but you're gonna like them, but you're definitely not gonna show them that because that way nothing can happen here, and that's what's gonna drag them to you. That you're not that easy on giving yourself out. Also, it could be this person doing certain rituals at night. I don't know. Maybe they're manifesting something. They're, uh, maybe they just like to be in nature uh, when there is a moon, moonlight, and stuff like that. <clears throat> then let's ask, how is their career, finances? Even though I already saw, I still want to look more. What about their career, finances? Where do they stand? Where do they work, maybe? I already said many things before, but I'll see what else, what kind of information 
uh, this person has lots of plans, lots of um, ideas, lots of ideas. <clears throat> okay, it could also be that this person have to do something with uh, drinks or water or uh, beverages, I don't know, because I have lots of cups here. Mm-hmm. Could also be this person works somewhere uh, in the sea because of water again. I see water here. Doesn't have to be just for some. Let me see. But they love their work. I want to tell you they love what they do. It's like why they're making money because they love what they do. They're excited. They have so many uh, plans, so many ideas. They always accomplish their ideas. They start thinking, let's say they wake up in the morning, you, you know what? Today we're going to do this and that. It's like they're building their own empire, I want to say, career. They, uh, let's say today they're like, okay, if they have, let's say, a business, right? Something to do with beverages, for example. And then today they woke up and like, you know what? Today we have to order this and that. Today we have to try this and that. Very, a person with lots, lots of ideas and those ideas actually come to life. Uh, at the same time, this person is very patient, very patient, uh, and they know how to wait on what they want to accomplish. If they want to accomplish something, they will, uh, they will wait for their opportunity. Mm -hmm. Yes, for some, this person could work with partners, uh, not by them themselves. There's also other people uh, around them. What I'm saying, this, this job is not like they just, um, it, even though it could be, even if they're office worker, right? Still, they always on the phone with someone. They always talk about ideas. They're not just sitting and bored in their office and doing nothing or just doing whatever uh, needs to be done, like followed by someone orders. No, they are the one who brings ideas. Even if they're not their own boss, they're still the one who gives out ideas, I want to say here, okay? So, but... Um, could also be for some this person is traveling for work and um, do certain projects. I, I sense projects here, project, business, um, something to do with water again. I, maybe they, they live next to certain water. Um, very energetic at what they do. Also very patient, as I said, maybe they're growing something. Maybe they're growing something and waiting for it to grow or their idea to come to life. And as soon as their idea working, that's when they get the money, okay? They, they, they get paid for their ideas and whatever they put into their thoughts. That's what I want to say here, okay? I hope it's not too complicated, but it's a general reading. I see many things together. And let's see how things will start between you. How things will start. Let me see. How things will start or go between you. How things will start between you. <laughs> this person will instantly want to uh, be in touch with you, to communicate with you. They will ask either for your number or for if you work together or you came to their work, they will make sure they have your contact, uh, whatever they need to, communi to continue communicating with them. If maybe you are the one there, um, if they're making your, doing your project, Maybe you came for uh, to do something or, or build something and they are doing your project. They will make sure they will do everything in their power to get the most out of it. So you see how their um, 
trying to help you okay they will try to help you. also uh financially this uh, this person might even try and help you financially to solve something for you so you see that they care for you okay to show their uh attraction in a way through work okay through some deeds also this person how it's gonna start they will start giving you gifts um some presents gifts uh, you're gonna get from them asking you maybe on a date or asking you for lunch uh, asking you to uh work with them on certain thing or certain project something they they will put a lot of effort into this relationship they will put a lot of effort into it and you would feel uh in a way how serious this person about you very serious how else yes <clears throat> this person will also realize that uh, if they're not gonna do anything you are not willing to do anything here so they will understand eventually by your character by your by your personality that they have to be the magician here and start uh working your way because you are not planning to do anything because you feel like they have to do it or you feel like uh, you only will do 50 50 50 percent there putting effort and 50 you you want equal give and take here uh, without them not doing not doing anything nothing is happening here so they're taking taking things into their own hands here and start moving your way because they like you very very much and if at that moment when you meet you have certain financial problems or something bothers you there they will try and help and solve this problem for you. So don't think that uh, they try to uh, make you feel bad because they have more than you. No, they just trying to be nice and help and solve your problem because they do care here. They will think a lot about this um, connection. Uh, they will have a lot of plans and ideas that they're not gonna tell you right away. But they already will have some ideas about you and about your future together. Since this is your future spouse. You wouldn't even start thinking yet how they already have everything solved. So this relationship will go very fast. Yes. This person will, will fight for you. This person will... Uh, make plans for your future uh, for building a house together or having a house or home together uh, yes you gonna be in their mind as the empress any gender uh, if they already will put plans in their head how to uh, how to uh, be a family with you okay <clears throat> and this is great this person could be an air sign doesn't have to be but as i said very smart um person here and finally when approximately when approximately you can meet this person let me see this is general reading but you'll try and see here when approximately you can meet okay prince of spring spring time could be for some for some winter time so from winter to spring and the chariot uh, it's happening pretty much soon i don't feel uh in two three years i more feel within a year or so <clears throat> because with the chariot this person already rushing into your life could be for some even seven days seven uh, weeks or seven months up to seven months i want to say yes again winter so up to seven months i feel you might already meet this person but uh, not more than a year i want to say here as well okay <clears throat> yes but this person is definitely rushing into your life already if you don't know them already i want to tell you that but let me know in comments guys please if you if you recognize this person or this is someone you will meet soon thank you very much and i'll talk to you soon guys bye bye Okay, whoever chose pile number three, this uh, blue stone, 
Hello, guys. And let's see. Who is your future spouse? Let's see their personality, their characteristics, or something you need to know about them. Some information you need to know about your future spouse. Who are they? Very hardworking person. Very hardworking in a way um, where they're willing to even move to another country or city as long as there is a prosperity there is there is a chance for them just an example that's how they are if there is an, an a chance for them to move to another city or country they're willing to do it if there will be more prosperity there if if they, let's say they fell in love with someone right they are willing difficult or not they're willing to go to this person they're willing to move they're um they're not the one who will take years for them to make one decision no this person um knows that sometimes things need to be done for them to start new they're ready to be to start new yes for their own success they're willing to do something <clears throat> to make changes for their success especially when it comes to work finances they're willing to move places to travel uh, they're ready for that maybe they're traveling for work and look at what came out eight of pentacles exactly maybe this person is traveling for work or they're searching themselves in different places uh, when, when they can make more money or they be more stable they also i feel this person when you meet them <coughs> sorry when you meet this person this person will be ready for a family with the empress this person maybe will be in search for um for their other half any gender okay or maybe they're willing to move into to your city or take you to their own city or country. Uh, could be you live in different cities or countries as well. Uh, they're not afraid to do that. Okay. Who else is this person? Very patient. Sometimes, even if they uh, something goes wrong, uh huh, interesting. Wow, uh, when things go wrong, right? Usually, people react differently, right? It depends on each person, but this person never gives up. This person, if something goes wrong, he use they use their patience. What they do is they start looking for new chances with the lover. They look for new opportunities, and they actually find them. So they don't uh, sit there and be in depression or maybe they could sit two, three days and then they pick up themselves and continue moving. Okay. This person is not the one who will sit and wait for um, someone, uh, things change around them. No, they will be the changer. They will be the one who change things around. They will be the one who will take a chance. If something goes wrong in their job, they will find another one. And this another one will give them even more. Okay? So this person is willing, is very good with changes. Very good. <clears throat> they try to look uh, to see more positive things even into the negative. Even there's something happens, they say, you know what, if this happened, it means I needed to change things around. Uh, and eventually they realize that it was only for good. Who else is this person? And that's why today when you meet them, this person, or at least when you will be already as a family, this person will be very financially abundant. Because they know how to provide for their family. They know what's best for them and their family. They're ready as I said, they could be already ready for uh, building a family uh, as soon as they fall in love. Uh, yes, they're ready to make changes in their life. I feel for many, this person is, uh, for many, this you know this person already. You already met with the six of uh, cups. Or for others, this is will be uh, this person will be like your soulmate. You're going to feel this uh, great connection with them. 
but for some it is person already in your surroundings and you might even know them already okay let's see how can you possibly meet how can you possibly meet how can you possibly meet mm -hmm. okay you either will attend some um, event or be with your friends with your family uh, you might yeah go to some uh, courses or a concert I don't know somewhere where other people will be and that's how you meet this person maybe this person will be the one who will perform something or do something there when you will notice them <clears throat> For others, you might go out with your friends for drinks. Look at this. Uh, this woman looks like a waiter here. Waitress. Uh, and maybe you will meet there. Where you will have drinks with your friends. Going out more into the evening time. Uh, when there is a sunset. Evening time I see here. Okay. What else? What else? Because it's a general reading. Yes, for some people will go to a restaurant. Something to do with, yes, um, having a great time. You go into a restaurant or you go into a store or you go into uh, your family and there you have drinks and uh, foods. Uh, for some, not a big amount, you will meet at work. Yes, but for most I see evening time. Evening time uh, when um, there is the moon. Moon is up, not the sun. Or sunset or evening time. I want to say here, okay? How can you meet? Yes, uh, you would feel instant attraction with this person. Sexual attraction. Uh, this person you would see in them that they're very wise and also uh, they're very mature it doesn't matter how old they are you would feel uh, this person is very mature wise and they already ready for a committed relationship somehow either they tell you this or you would feel that uh, and yes it might happen in the evening time because the stars the stars when the stars are up beautiful okay and let's see um let's look uh, let's look at their finances and their career what are they doing exactly what uh, what is their work related to mm -hmm. tower just came out could be they work at some high rising building or what else it could mean mm -hmm. Or they, they changed their job recently. They're changing their job because something didn't work out. Maybe they were fired or uh, they're just changing their career. Because they, they don't like where they are, where, and they're changing. As I said, remember in the beginning, this person is okay with changing things around if something doesn't work. So uh, basically something didn't work for them in the past or wouldn't work when you meet them. And they will be into this change. They might even move to another country or city. Maybe they move into your city to get a better job. Mm -hmm. uh, could also be this person have to do something with law forces. Um, I don't know, just an example. Uh, law office, uh, security, police something to do with law where the law prevails maybe even they work in prison for some doesn't have to be but for little amount of people uh, they do something uh, have to do with law as uh, some um, yeah mm -hmm. somewhere where the justice have to uh, prevail because yes something like that so maybe they're changing their uh, department or they decided they don't like where they are they want to change it yes 
this person definitely um, something to do I, I feel strongly to do with justice law could be also medical field here mm -hmm. for most this person holds high positions even but uh, they work for someone it's not really a business here for most they work in certain department or they uh, work in the office or they work as I said maybe they literally work somewhere in the police or prison something to do with law it, or if even medical field but somewhere where there is important um, this place is important in a way for people because people's life are at stake Let's say if you go into hospital and this person is a doctor, it's very important because he saves lives. If he works in prison, there are prisoners who uh, need uh, justice, like justice is there. They, by law, something by law. Police, same thing. Um, even just security, something to do with law. yeah so that's what i feel they could also again change their place workplace at the time when you meet because they don't like where they are and as i said this is still king of pentacles person who knows how to make money who knows how to provide for their family okay even if they're changing job doesn't mean they're uh, broken even if they're broken uh they will very fast pick up because that's such person and let's see how things will start between you two when you meet. And and before, remember I told you, uh, you will meet at the evening time and everything was dark in there. It could also mean you will could meet in there either office or in the courtroom or in prison uh, if you both work there. Just an example, right? Uh, police uh, something in the dark place where um, yeah or um, hospital some place could be if this is a place where you where it's not the time to have fun okay when there is justice there there is something with, about people's lives sorry if i'm too long explaining but for others you can meet at a place where you have drinks and stuff doesn't if, if it's not related to work okay but evening time or just a dark place and let's see how things will start between you how this relationship will start <laughs> Uh, right away, this relationship will start very serious. Uh, you both serious people here. I see you both uh, want uh, similar things. You both want a family here. So you wouldn't take uh, uh, any easy, like um, non-committed relationship into consideration. And this person as well, this person again, hold certain status or people know them well so they're not ready to just you know play around they want someone stable so you are and this will start with passion as well but at the same time uh, you will instantly feel that you need each other I just saw number 21 I don't know why number 21 okay how this will start with lots of passion lots of you will be drawn to each other but this uh sexual attraction will eventually lead to uh, a family because uh just for some little amount you might uh or this person might depends on your gender get pregnant here and that's how you will be married eventually but be aware that um you're not gonna get in certain situation because you might get pregnant 
uh, easily because you will have so much passion with this person. Okay? Yes. So things will go very passionately, but at the same time very serious. I don't know how is it possible, but you will. Uh, this person will have plans for you. Uh, yes, in the future they would want to be with you. They will uh, hold you in their head because they will fall in love with you. And they will be, uh, yes, very serious about you with the king of wands. Um, this person will be ready for a family. So again, either someone gets pregnant right away and that's how you get married. Or uh, it's just a warning for you about to be careful not to get pregnant right away. Or it just will start with passion and will end with um, committed relationship here, okay? And finally, when approximately... When approximately can this happen? When approximately? <coughs> Sorry. <coughs> when approximately? It's a general reading, remember. Again, spring. I have most of my readings today. I mean, most of the piles, they have spring. Spring time. The Emperor. Mm -hmm. Four. Could be in four months or springtime. Prince of Autumn. Uh, from, I want to say, from a springtime going into the fall time. The next year. Within the next year, I want to say, you can meet. Yes, within the next year, from spring, summer to uh, fall. Those, uh, this moment. Yes, and that's the two of summer who that shows that there will be, uh, I want to say, instant mutual connection, uh, uh, mutual interests here you will have with this person. You will be a great match. Yeah, no wonder you're going to be, you know, this is your future spouse, I'm just saying. Uh, so thank you very much guys let me know in comments if maybe you already know such person or you don't yet that's to totally okay thank you very much and i'll see you soon bye bye <clears throat>
Um, there are many lessons you will have to go through with this person. I want to warn you right away. But I see that no matter what, this connection has to come to Queen of Pentacles. Uh, this connection will eventually grow into something more. It might start from you being lovers. Because I have the High Priestess here, okay? It might start from hidden connection. It could also, uh, you could also meet each other at work, or maybe you work with one another, or maybe you help in something with each other. Uh, some help, financial help could be as well. Uh, it could also be... This person didn't plan to fall in love with you, I'll tell you that. But they got into their own trap, in, which means they could have been broken other people's hearts here before. They couldn't be lied to other people. Uh, they, co they could have been in certain third party situations before, uh, or maybe they are with you, with you right now in a third party. But they didn't plan for you to be someone stable for them. They didn't plan for it. They they started very uh, light or will start with you very on a light terms. But the, uh, the thing is, eventually, they will have to make a decision about you. Why? Because you are a very important person in their life. They will realize through all this uh, pain that you will go through, through all these lies and maybe even betrayals, they will somehow realize that you are their person. Again, this is a general reading. Uh, don't think, okay, this is all negative and I don't even want such person. No, uh, it could be that it's going to be easier for you, for someone it's going to be harder because it's a general reading. But some... Um, I'm just explaining you what kind of person it is and what kind of life they uh, live, okay? It could be with you or maybe it is just them being with someone else before and before they meet you, okay? For everyone is different. And for many, I feel you already know this person and you already going through those lessons with them, karmic lessons. Uh, you could have been into a fight many times. Uh, this relationship could be so um, uncertain you at times you even think why are you even there with this person still you just want to leave them but you can't because uh, they're your karmic or they're your soulmate you cannot leave them your heart is still beats for them and they're the same they're hiding very well their feelings or in when you meet this person they will hide their feelings very well uh, into their heart they even might show coldness to you uh, maybe say sharp words to you, say something you're not going to like, and then you're going to leave and come back, and they're going to come back, and you leave, and stuff like that going on, but they still adore you, they still love you, they still feel you are the best choice they can ever have in their life, even though they would never tell this to you, at least not anytime soon. And that's the personality of this person, but why all this happening? Because they've been hurt in their childhood somehow uh, their inner child is hurt and that's why they put things in, they only keep things to themselves they do not open up they're not used to uh sp spread their feelings around or their thoughts uh they're very secretive in their nature very secretive person uh but you came to this person life or will come to this person life to teach them a lesson that um they might be secretive, they might be in certain unhealthy relationships, but eventually they will have to get to the point, and that's their lesson with you, that you, uh, they will have to choose some, not what's good for them, but what their heart wants, and their heart wants you, for you to be in a family, to be happy, to have kids maybe. Uh, that's what they will have to come to realization. And that's their lesson. Okay? You both going through a certain lesson, but we're talking about this person right now. And let's see, how can you possibly meet with this person? How can you meet? Let me see. How can you meet? How this meeting 
can happen or maybe already happened for for many I want to say how can you meet It could be you from different uh, countries or cities. You might have different backgrounds. Maybe uh, you met on the internet. Uh, social media could be as well. And you were talking while you were away from each other. Maybe at a distance. For others. Because this is a general reading. For others. For others you met uh, at certain event with your, at your family. family. Uh, if just for some, this is very, very little amount. I, I want to say uh, we can count even them. <clears throat> you could have met at a, someone's funeral or you went to someone's house when someone uh, lost someone and you were there and you met this person. For others, you met again at some event, your family, wedding, uh, if not on social media. Okay. Who else? What else? Where else can you meet? Okay, so for some you went out for drinks or you had a date with this person maybe. Uh, went out for drinks and you met this person. And you instantly felt attraction with the two, two of chalices. Uh, something about drinks or having a, just having a good time maybe. Um, for some, you were doing something, maybe working or doing something in nature and this person appeared, okay? Maybe you were just enjoying nature, meditating, I don't know, and this person came. How else? Or will come, sorry, I'm talking about like in the past because for many you already know this person. Yes, for others, uh, this person uh, came from another uh, country or city. It's certain movement happened here. Uh, they moved either to your city or they came to you or they will plan to come to you because you at the distance. For many, you at the distance and met on, the, on social media, internet, and this person wants to come or you want to come and meet them. Okay. Uh, also could be a hint you either if you met in uh, reality not on social media or on like uh, dating sites uh, this person you either meet them very early in the morning or uh, very late at night it depends if you're going for drinks yes you can meet at night uh, if uh, it's about work or you into nature meditating it could be very early in the morning within the sunrise time okay Maybe you went to some um, healing session and this person was also there. Maybe you went to do yoga in the morning and this person was also meditating near you or at the same yoga class as you. Okay, could be. But for most I feel this person is uh, at the distance, at least in the beginning was at the distance with you or will be at the distance with you. Okay. Yes, <laughs> for many you already know this person, six of chalices, person either from your past or someone that you already in a relationship with or are right now not talking maybe or got into a fight, whatever happened there. Yes, and this person is watching you somewhere. Okay, let's see uh, their career, finances, what they do for life. Let me see so you know approximately who they are. What are they doing for their finances, career, life, this person? Mm -hmm. I want to tell you it's not easy for them with uh, finances right now. Okay. Or when you will meet or right now. Something uh, is not working well for them. Something has ended. Maybe uh, they lost a job. Uh, they lost something, maybe they lost money literally, or um, maybe the business didn't go. Something happened with their finances here. And 
where is this going yes but they will start over they will start over will go through a certain transformation leave the old and they going into the king of pentacles so um they will pick up king of pentacles uh very prosperous and uh they will they will start making money again from the scratch i want to say maybe they will open their own business because king of pentacles uh usually talks about uh, businessmen or uh, someone who holds uh, who their own boss or just um, financially abandoned they will pick up right now if they're don't doing well not doing well know that they will pick up but what their uh, job or work related to what is it related to could be their had their own um, business let's say restaurant or cafe or something with to do with water maybe <clears throat> but this person uh, is thinking with their head they are smart they uh, as i said for many they have their business or their businessmen in general yes um what else they can be they okay, can do Yes, they're doing, uh, they're very good at their craft. They some specialist, they specialize in something here. Could be medical field. Just for some, very little amount, this person could be into gynecology. Because I feel maybe they, um, because I feel this empress, it's like she's uh, somehow i don't know i feel it she gives birth and they receive a child maybe they're a gynecologist in reality like maybe they're a doctor and right now something happened maybe they lost their job or position due to quarantine i don't know what happened there or maybe they just it doesn't have to mean that they lost something it also can mean they changed maybe they changed their office they changed their workplace but whatever they do, they're very good at it. That's why they're still king of pentacles because they know how to make money. It's just at a certain moment, there will be certain problem. If this is not a doctor, just an example. It was just an example. Uh, let's say they had their own business. They will pick up uh, with uh, the help of somebody else. Uh, maybe the new partner will come and offer them uh, to do business together because they are knowledgeable at certain uh, field. Maybe they will open their office or they will open a new restaurant because the other one didn't work. You know what I mean here? Uh, they still have this knowledge in their head that they can use uh, in the future. It's not that they lost a job and they have nothing to do or have no profession or have no knowledge uh, in anything no they still have certain knowledge that they will use in the future but maybe with the help of other person here someone who's already abandoned okay yes because this person is very wise it, it they hold lots of knowledge and people willing to pay them just for be using uh, having this knowledge either in business or by being a professional let's say a lawyer or a doctor or someone else and the other person will help them maybe to open uh to come back to come back yes uh, because they love their job they love what they do they love their profession um and that will pick them up okay for some it has to do with drinks and um maybe restaurant or cafe or something to do with beverages okay and uh let's see how things will start between you how this relationship will go how will it go when you meet Well, at first you wouldn't really understand this person as i said this is uh this relationship is not easy so at first uh you might would want to hold on close off from this person or they will be uh going into their head uh thinking waiting because there are certain problems other problems they have they're not sure what they want uh and then they will come back and again they will might um make you un into uncertainties and then leave and then be back it's like come and go things 
in the beginning as i said this won't won't be you wouldn't even think that this person can be your future spouse why because even though you have feelings you still feel uh how am i gonna survive in such connection this person is so unstable emotionally how am i going to work with this how but you will <laughs> because this is your future spouse how through a transformation uh this person will go eventually through a major transformation it could be many little transformations during the road when he they come and go but it uh, eventually it could also be a major transformation when they will realize that they cannot live without you they are not ready to lose you and they want to have a family with you and you if you um will have enough strength to wait for this person to transform um if this is your fate this is your person i guess there is nothing else can be here so this person will eventually transform and become a family person who will uh, who can give you stability okay uh, but this will take time as i said yes and they will learn how to uh, know your worth if in the beginning they weren't sure uh, they will be sure that you are very worthy, that you're very important in their life and that they want you to be their family. They don't want to share you with anyone else. They want to share their pentacles with you. They want to share their life with you. And they will realize that uh, and finally will go away from this two of pentacles when they were not sure. They will finally know how to make a decision and stop lying to themselves because they are lying to themselves that they don't either don't like you or don't love you or uh, they want to be with you. No, they are lying to themselves that they actually see a potential. Um, they, I miss, I'm sorry, actually there is a potential they can be here but they're uh, going away from it because of their own fears that i was talking in the beginning that they're uh very closed off in general very um not trusting anyone and they will learn how to trust you they will learn how to trust you and trust their own intuition and that's when they will start moving your way with something more stable uh, they will start moving and uh, use their own power, use um, their head to make things work. They are going away from their fears, from their past, how they were before. And they're looking into the future. They start making plans. That's how things will go between you eventually, okay? And uh, finally, let's see when approximately such person may enter your life when approximately let me see when approximately uh, this is a general reading remember okay we cannot uh, it cannot be the same for everyone but approximately let me see when you can meet four of summer it could be either a uh, summertime or could be four weeks four months um if you already know this person maybe you already met at summertime or on the fourth month i don't know something before or summer could be what else life experience exactly this could be your karmic partner as i said who you will have to go through certain lessons with before you um reunite and be together as a family also five of winter could be a uh, winter time for some and finally what else yes eight of winter so could be from five to eight weeks five to eight months um so mostly i see winter and summer time okay yes but anyway maybe four eight or five means something to you those dates okay so that's what i had for you today uh pile number four let me know in comments if you already know this person because i feel for many you already dealing with such person and it's not easy if not i mean <laughs> you might meet such person in the future uh, or maybe it's just not your pile thank you very much guys let me know and i'll talk to you soon Bye bye